uh, I really couldn't imagine because I have been the team's biggest skeptic. I was kind of prepared of finding just a stone. For me, it has been an amazing experience, I must say. The team were completely dwarfed by the mysterious object, which is about 60 meters in diameter and lying almost 80 meters down on the bottom of the Baltic Sea. There are visible formations on top of the object, which are set at a 90 degree angle and look like passageways or walls, as well as something that looks like it could be a staircase. The Baltic Sea anomaly is an anomaly in the best sense of the term. It is a 70 meter long object, with numerous sharp edges and right angles prevalent throughout its structure, with a set of stairs on one side, as if deployed from its shape and left to ruin. Sonar has also found drag marks behind the object, samples have confirmed it is made of metal, geologist Steve Weiner said that according to his tests, the object was not a geological formation, suggesting that the structure was in fact made from metals which nature could not reproduce itself. Electrical equipment also has mysterious issues when near to the anomaly. Professional diver. Stefan Hadjaborn, part of the Ocean X team said, anything electric out there, and the satellite phone as well, stopped working when we were above the object, then when we got away about 200 meters, it turned on again. Lindbergh isn't convinced that the object is actually an ET spacecraft. In response to one question about what the object might be, Lindbergh responded, I think it is very odd in its shape. It is tough to give an explanation as to what it might be exactly, since different scientists have many different theories. Whatever it is, it is something we do not usually find in nature. Sitting in the dark cold depths of the Baltic Sea, it is thought to be over 140,000 years old. Ocean X is currently investigating the object, I will keep you updated. imagine because I have been the team's biggest skeptic. I was kind of prepared of finding just a stone. For me it has been an amazing experience I must say.